Hi, this is Jensen Ersides. Today I'm going to do an overview of felsic and mafic igneous rocks. We will start with felsic rocks. First thing you need to know is that felsic igneous rocks can be intrusive or they can be extrusive. Here's our scheme for igneous rocks. Our felsic igneous rocks are on the left side of this scheme. Felsic rocks are classified by three characteristics. Felsic rocks are lighter in color. Felsic rocks have a low density. And felsic rocks are composed of silica and aluminum. And this is all told to you on the reference table on the scheme for igneous rocks. Here's an example of rhyolite. Rhyolite is a felsic extrusive igneous rock. Moving on to mafic igneous rocks. Mafic igneous rocks can also be intrusive or extrusive. Here's our scheme again. Mafic igneous rocks on the right side of, this, of our scheme for igneous rocks. Mafic igneous rocks are also classified by three characteristics. It's kind of just like the opposite of felsic. Uh, mafic igneous rocks are dark in color. Mafic Igneous rocks have a high density, and mafic rocks are composed of iron and magnesium. And again, it tells you all this on the scheme for igneous rocks. Here's an example of basalt. It is a mafic extrusive igneous rock. I hope this was helpful. Please check out other playlists I've made on this topic. And have a great day.